Hello students, welcome to Engineers Academy. Let's solve this one another problem. In this problem, we are required to determine the magnitude and orientation theta of a V so that the resultant force is directed along the positive y axis and has a magnitude of 1500 Newton. Right? So, in this problem, it is said that the resultant is acting in the positive y direction. Right? So, this is the resultant vector, let's say. Right? And its magnitude is 1500 Newton and we are required to find this Fb magnitude and this theta, right? So, this means that the Rx component of the resultant, the component of the resultant in the x direction is 0, right? right? Since R, Ry is equal to R, right? The whole resultant is acting in the positive y direction, right? So, this means that the Ry component of the resultant is equal to 1500 Newton, right? And as we know that Rx is equal to the summation of all components of given vectors in the x direction, right? So, we can say that this will be equal to Fax plus Fbx, right? And since Rx is equal to 0, so we can say that Fax plus Fbx, this will be equal to 0, right? And similarly, we can write that the Ry will be equal to Fay, the summation of the components of the forces in the y direction, right? So, Fay plus Fby and this will be equal to 1500, right? Since this is given, 1500 Newtons, right? So, for that, I will find the components of Fe first, right? So, if, if we look into this Fe, so it is making 30 degrees with the y axis, right? So, it will have one component in this direction, right? And this, this is, this purple one is F A Y and this will be the cos component, right? So, and similarly, we can write that this is 700 cos of 30 degrees, right? And similarly, we will have one another component of this F A in this direction parallel to the x axis, right? So, this will be, this is F A X and this will be the sine component, right? Oh, so, we can write this is 700 sine of 30 degrees, right? And similarly, if we resolve this Fb into its components, right? So, it will have one component, Fb will have one component which will be acting in this direction, right? In the negative x direction, right? So, this will be Fbx and similarly, it will have one another component which will be acting in this direction and this is F b y right so if this is the angle theta then f b x is f b cos of theta and this is this f b sine of theta right so now we have these two equations right so f a x is 700 we can write that this is 700 sine of 30 degrees plus f b x right so f b x is f b cos of theta so we can write and as we can see that Fbx is acting in the negative x direction, right? So, we will write minus sign with it, right? So, we can say that this is minus, right? So, this is minus Fb cos of theta, right? So, I will write minus Fb cos of theta and this is equal to 0. So, from this we can write that Fb cos of theta is equal to 700 sine of 30 degrees, right? So, let us say that this is equation 1. And similarly, from this equation F A Y, so F A Y is 700 cos of 30. So, I will write 700 cos of 30 degrees plus F B Y is positive, right? Since it is acting in the positive y direction. So, this is F B sine of theta. So, I will write plus F B sine of theta and this is equal to 1500 Newtons. Right? And similarly, from this, we can write that Fb sine of theta is equal to 1500 minus 700 cos of 30 degrees, right? So, let us say that this is equation 2. So, now, if we simplify this, then this Fb cos of theta is equal to 350, right? So, we can write that Fb cos of theta is equal to 350. Newtons, right? So, let us say that this is equation 1, right? 
And similarly, if we simplify this, then f b sine of theta is equal to, this is 1500 minus 700 cos of 30 degrees. Right, so this is 893.78, right? So 893.78 newtons. And let's say this is equation 2. Right, so now if I divide equation 2 by 1, right, so if we divide equation 2, so equation 2 is Fb sine of theta divided by Fb cos of theta. So this is 893.78 divided by 350, right. So Fb will cancel out and sine of theta divided by cos of theta is 10 theta, right. So from this theta is equal to 10 inverse and this ratio right so this is 893.78 divided by 350 so 10 inverse 893.78 divided by 350 right so this theta is 68.61 right so we can write that theta is 68.61 degrees and to find fb we can use uh, either equation 1 or equation 2 right so if i use equation 1 so from equation 1 fb magnitude is equal to 350 divided by cos of theta right and theta is now known which is 68.61 right so fb magnitude is 350 divided by cos of 68.61 so this is 959 so we can say that it is approximately 960 newtons right so if the resultant is acting in the positive y direction and its magnitude is 1500 newton then the fb magnitude is 960 newton and its angle with the negative x axis will be 68.61 degrees right so this is the solution of this particular problem